you for choosing UP. Obtaining a qualification from the University of Pretoria is the best step you could take to ensure a positive future. Now we will have a look at how you can access your UP portal after you have completed a successful online application. By accessing your UP portal, you can stay up to date with your journey at UP. If you still need to apply, head over to the UP online application video that will guide you through your application. You can find the link to this video and other useful links in the description below. Let's access your UP portal. For administrative purposes, you have been allocated a student number or EMPL ID that you have received in an email. Please wait 48 hours after receipt of this email before you access the UP portal. Take note that this student number does not imply that your application for admission has been successful. You must use this student number in all future interactions with UP. To visit the Student Centre, you need to do the following. Go to the UP website at www.up.ac.za. Click on My UP Login. If you have not registered on the UP portal before, click on New User. Enter your username, which is your student number starting with a U, and your 13 digit South African ID number or passport number that you used with your application. Click on Proceed. You will now be guided to create a new password for future use. Once you are done, enter your username, your newly created password and click Submit. Now that you are signed in, you can click on the Go button in the Student Centre section. Welcome to UP Student Centre. You should visit the UP Student Centre regularly to stay updated. For example, go to the Admissions Tile section to track your admission status or view your communications under the Documents and Communications Tile section. Should you experience any difficulty, please call the UP Student Help Desk at 012-420-3837 or email them at studenthelp at up.ac.za. Alternatively, you can visit www.up.ac.za forward slash portal help. If you are admitted as a student, remember to accept or reject your offer in the admissions tile section. After accepting the offer, you can head over and view the video on completing your online contract. You are now one step closer to making the most of your journey with us as you prepare for the world beyond university.